Hi everybody, welcome back to the Pixar Cars Thomas and Friends Fan Channel. Today we're going to open up a new place that's from Pixar Cars, and it's called the Neon Race Car Set. And I want to show you first, we have four Neon Cars we purchased and opened up in the last four videos. You can see them by clicking on our channel. There's Max Schnell, Raul Carul, and of course Lightning McQueen, and Shu Todoroki. Now, I'm going to zoom way out, I'm going to put the playset box right here in front of us. There is the Neon Knights track set. Okay, and it's by Disney Pixar Cars. And we got it at Target, it was only $14. And I think inside there might be some cars too, I'm not sure. But we already have lots of cars, so I'm not worried about that. So here's the, tr the track. It's got a ramp here, and you put the cars, and it goes over a jump, and we see who wins. So let's open this box right now and see what's inside. There, the whole package is right there. And let's see what's in here. Oh, this is the, the bus, isn't it? At the end? Oh, wow. Check that out. Does it change or something when you move the sign? What's it do? Oh, I bet it does watch the switch here. That's pretty cool. Now let's sort this stuff out and see what we have to do. So it looks like they have about 14 pieces to put together in this kit. And it came with instructions on where to put the stickers. So we're gonna put the stickers on first. Here's a sticker sheet right here and it tells us where to put them. So our first two stickers go here, Neotech and 95. The next two stickers go on this blue piece, and the last two stickers go right here on this blue piece. So now, what's the next step? We'll take these two green pieces, like the image says, and put this part right in here. Yeah, that looks perfect. The next step, take this green part here and mount it in these two holes there. And these go under each support. That looks good so far. Let me zoom back a little bit so you can see a little better. There we go. Now the next step, I was about to put the side supports on and realized this here, the first step I did was in the wrong place. It's supposed to go like this, like that. That's how you dump the cars out for the race. I was wondering how that's gonna work. Okay, now these go in right here. Perfect. That's good and strong. Now the next step is to install these two pieces of track here. Just like this. Okay, they're in. And then we bring these three parts over. And this part goes right in here. That looks good so far. You see that? Now this piece fits right in like that. Nice and snug. And then, that joins on right here. Look at that, perfect fit so far. And the big bus fits right in there. Let's have a look at this track. First we have the launching pad up here. We pick this up and drop the cars down. They shoot down the track and go over the ramp and we see who wins. So we're all set to go here, folks, and we got the switch in the middle, and when the car runs over this here, the sign will change, and it's gonna show Lightning McQueen and Raul Carul in this preliminary race to show you how it works, and we'll just do it twice, and I'll fill in the ending. Different places, okay, here goes. It looks like Lightning McQueen won that. Let's see the replay. Here we go again with another rematch. I'll try and move the camera right fast. So that works really good. We're gonna have lots of fun with this racetrack because we have tons and tons of cars to try. If you want uh, to send some comments as to tips on which cars we can do in our next race, let us know and we'll promise to get them all up there. Hi everybody, welcome back to the Pixar Cars Thomas and Friends Fan Channel. It's a beautiful day in Radiator Springs and all the cars were heading for their morning visit with Flo at the VA Cafe when suddenly they heard Sheriff coming. Gather around, everyone gather around, they got some great news. Hang on, said Sheriff. I'll turn on my dash cam. I have to tell you a great big story. 
You wouldn't believe what's going on, said Sheriff. All the cars from the World Grand Prix are coming to Radiator Springs, and we're going to have some races on the Neon Knights track set. Whoa, they said. They couldn't believe it. Doc said, are you sure it's going to be okay there, Sheriff? Yeah, no problem. Um, the Motormax racing truck is dragging the set right to Radiator Springs, and I think I hear it coming now. I can hear it coming. Yes, here it comes now. Let's turn around and have a look. Turn off my dash cam so we can all watch this come in. Here comes a Motormax racing team truck hauling in the giant racetrack. Here he comes now. Check it out. Whoa, what a big load. Hold it there, Motormax. That's perfect, said Sheriff. Good location. Now go get the rest of the haulers so we can all get ready for the big races. I heard the World Grand Prix cars are on their way. No problem, said Motormax, I'm on my way. In the meantime, said Sheriff, let's all get outside and wait for the cars to come. I hear they're gonna come in a big row. Great, that's great, said Doc. We'll all get outside. They're all lined up, waiting for the cars. I think I hear them coming now. Yes, they're on their way. Here they come now. Here comes Neon Lightning. Francesca Bernoulli. Max Schnell. Tutoroki, Raul Carul, Jeff Corvette, Miguel Camino, Nigel Gearsley, Rip Toczkonski, and Carlo Veloso. All ten cars are here. All right, let's get them lined up for the big races. It was Sheriff's job to pick out who's going to race the first five races. Let's see what we have here. Our first race contenders. Carlo Veloso and Rip Klutschkanski up on the launch. Let's go up and see what's going to happen here now, guys. There. There's a full shot. I'll turn on the other camera. And first race is Rip Klutschkanski and Carlo Veloso. Ooh, that was definitely Carlo Veloso. The next contenders. Max Schnell, Raul Carul. Three, two, one. Oh, that was definitely Raul Kaul. The third race. Jeff Corvette, Miguel Camino. Oh, that was definitely Jeff Corvette. Their next race is Shu Todoroki and Nigel Gearsley. Oh, definitely Shu Todoroki. And finally, the last race for the day is Lightning McQueen and Francesca Bernoulli. Here goes. Oh, it's a photo finish. We'll have to watch that on the replay, but I think Lightning won the race. Well, that's our first heat for the day, folks. I hope you liked our races. Let's line them up and see how they look. We wouldn't know until we see the replays, but I think our first five contenders are Carlo Veloso, Raul Carroll, Jeff Corvette, Neon Lightning McQueen, and Neon Shutoroki. We'll have to watch back in slow motion to see what happens. Hi everybody, welcome back to the Pixar Cars Thomas and Friends Fan Channel. In our last episode, the World Grand Prix racers were in town, Radiator Springs, for some races, and all the cars are gathered out front to watch the semifinals. And look, there's Chuck Choke Cables. He has a guest on his back there, look. Guido and Luigi saying, get down out of there, Guido. And over here we have the five qualifiers for the last couple of races we're gonna have here today. And there's everybody from Radiator Springs, look, just hanging around out front, waiting for the big race to come. And Sheriff has to decide who's going to race against whom. But there's only five racers. Sheriff says, we need one more racer, he said, to make it even. And no one volunteered. Next thing you know, out of nowhere. I got my red wheels on, said Doc. I'll race against you. Everyone was applauding like crazy. They couldn't believe Doc's going to race today. 
Sheriff said, perfect, I'll line you up. So of course, Sheriff put Lightning against Doc, Jeff Corbett against Raul Carroll, and Shuto Roki against Carlo Veloso. Okay, our first race today is gonna be these two right here, Carlo Veloso and Shuto Roki. And we have the other camera all set up on the racetrack. We're gonna record the race and show the replay back in slow motion. Check, camera's on. And the first two races are ready to go. Three, two, one. And that looked like Carlo Veloso wins that race. Let's see the replay. So we'll put Carlo Veloso back here. And now our next heat is going to be Raul Carul and Jeff Gorvet. The cars are ready to go. Let's get ready to watch. Zoom out a little bit. And see what we can see down here. Here goes. Three, two, one. Definitely Raul Carul that time. And finally, our big match today, Doc Hudson and Lightning McQueen. Let's get you guys up into the, the, the launch area. It's Doc Hudson with his racing red wheels and neon Lightning McQueen in the historic race of all times. Let's go back and zoom out a little bit. And here goes, I'll zoom out. Here goes, three, two, one. Oh my God, I think Doc won that race. I have to do it again. Three, two, one, go. Oh, Lightning McQueen won that time. Okay, folks, let's see what we have left here now. We have three cars left. Lightning McQueen, Raul Carroll, and Carlo Velosa. And we need another car to race. Who's it going to be? I'll do it, says Mater. Mater, you're going to race against World Grand Prix cars. Okay, Sheriff said you're going against Lightning. It's going to have Carlo Velosa and Raul Carroll in this turn. Here we go, we have Raul Carroll and Carlo Velosa in the launch. And let's zoom way back so we can see the end here. Even though we'll show the replay. Here goes. Definitely Raul Carroll. Okay, good. Now we're down to Lightning and Mater for this historic race in Radiator Springs on the Neon Knights racetrack. Take it easy, Mater. All you gotta know is ahead of Lightning. What's gonna happen here now? Here goes the race, race of all time. Ah, oh, but Lightning beat him. All right, now, now it's Lightning against Raul Carul. The last two races today. Lightning Queen gets in place. Raul Carul is ready, the camera's recording. Three, two, one, go! And Raul Carul won that race. Congratulations, Raul Carul, says Sheriff. Doc said, yes, congratulations. You're the racing champion of the first World Grand Prix in Radiator Springs. Hi everybody, welcome back to Pixar Cars, Thomas and Friends fan channel. We're back at Radiator Springs at the VA Cafe in front of the Neon Knights racetrack. We moved the racetrack back towards town because we wanted to get a better ending to our races. Some of our races are really close. See, there's the ending right there. But we extended the finish line this time. We moved all the cars out of the way for now. We're gonna move them in a second. See, there's our racetrack now. We're gonna make it a lot longer and there's our camera to record the finish line. We have that set up. And first thing we're gonna do is bring out the actual Neon cars. I thought the neon cars would race on this track because they have lights in them, but when I open them up, I'll show you what happened. Okay, here's our four neon cars. These are quite big, actually. This is Shu Todoroki, and he has lights. I'm going to turn all, all the lights on later to show you. I still have the stick stuck in that one. And we have Lightning McQueen, neon racer. There it is. And let's see, we have Raul Karul. nice lights come on he's really nice and finally Max Schnell there's our four neon racers see lights okay let's bring them back over to the track I'll show you the problem with these cars okay there's our four neon racers Max Schnell Lightning McQueen Shuto Doroki and Raul Krul they all have their lights on now watch how they look when I turn the lights off they look 
absolutely fantastic in the dark. Perfect. Now let's turn the light back on. I want to show you something very important. Okay, now here's the track. I'm going to put these neon racers on the track right here. I'm going to put Lightning McQueen and shoot Todoroki on the track. There's one problem. They don't fit. They're not made for this racetrack. I kind of got the impression that you could race these on the track when I bought them. But in reality, you're supposed to use the other cars. So there's Shu Todoroki die cast and Shu Todoroki with the LED lights. And there's Lightning McQueen die cast versus Lightning McQueen with the lights. Okay. Now we got that out of the way, we can't use those cars on these races at all. Let's put them away. Okay, so we have all the lights back on. Now let's move the cars out of the way. We're going to have some fun races today using the regular cars. Okay, we have all the cars set up this time. We have Chuck Choke Cables here recording the entire event. All the haulers are here at the end, the fans. And we have more fans over there. And look, all the cars are lined up, ready for the race. We're going to have a few races this time. If you have any ideas we want to race, let me know. And there's the track. So let me see, I'm going to put two cars up here. Raise the back and let them race down and whoever finishes first, we're going to do a slow motion replay to show you the ending. First up, we're going to have, as a joke, we're going to use John Lasseter die cast and the Pizza Planet delivery truck. They're going to be our first racers. Okay, there's John Lasseter and the Planet Pizza delivery truck loaded in. Did you see that? The Planet Pizza delivery truck beat John Lasseter. I guess he has to be fast. Our next race is Shu Todoroki and Carlo Veloso. Here goes. Whoa, Carlo Veloso, no problem. Watch the race again in slow motion. Next up is Rule Carol versus Max Chanel. He's anxious to go up there. Here goes. Well, it looks like Max Chanel got hooked on the, uh, the jump there, but Rule Carol won for sure. Next up is Jeff Gorbett and Miguel Camino. Here it goes. Whoa, Jeff Gorbett by your nose. Watch the replay. Next up, two of my favorites, Francesca Bernoulli and Rip Kutchgonski. Are we all set, guys? Here it goes. Three, two, one. Oh, look at that. He crashed. So it looks like Francesca Bernoulli won that race. Next up, Lightning McQueen versus Nigel Gearsley. Three, two, one. Oh, Nigel Gearsley beat him. Check the, check the slow motion. Last up, Mater versus Ramon. That's pretty funny. I wonder who's going to win that race. Here goes. Three, two, one. Oh. Let's do that again. Take your time, Mater. You went too fast. Three, two, one. Oh, Mater got hooked. Okay, looks like Ramon won that race. Well, that's all we're going to do today, folks. Hang on a second. There's no real winner this time, but I guess you could say, I guess it's safe to say the real winner was... The Pizza Planet delivery truck. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you liked the video of the uh, Neon Nights races in downtown Radiator Springs. And again, here's our nice big bright LED neon cars. Here goes the lights off. Thanks for watching, everybody, and have a great day.